Thank you, Steve. Now, before thousands of fans can enjoy the action on the court, they have to get up to the dome first. Yeah, driving, the parking, the walking, that's probably, I think, probably some of the biggest hassles to get into the dome, right? Absolutely. Yeah, it's minor, but it is a hassle, especially when it's as cold as it's going to be tomorrow. News Channel Line's Andrew Donovan shows us two local companies are changing the game for getting to the dome. When Michael Krupa takes his five-year-old son Connor to the dome, their pregame tradition is at the former Hotel Syracuse. We were here on, on game days. The atmosphere was incredible, and I remember that when I was little. Um, and when they opened the hotel back up, it was just a no-brainer. Starting at the Marriott leads a quick walk to the Saturday shuttle. Yeah, it's shuttle service from the Central Transit Hub that brings people right up to the hill. Four dollars round trip and free parking. They park inside the hotel's parking garage, kitty corner from Shaughnessy's, which the bartender will validate. For us, we're usually trying to find a spot where we don't have to pay, and that puts us down near East Genesee Street, so the walk is much shorter from where we're dropped off from the bus. The Saturday shuttle drops fans off at the Centro bus stop on Waverly Avenue in front of the Shine Student Center. From there, Orange Nation will head up the hill toward the Hall of Languages and the Quad. It's about a five-minute walk, which isn't so bad considering the temperature forecasted for tip-off is 20 degrees, but it will feel even colder with the wind that's known on the SU Hill. You're parking in a covered garage. Um, you're, you have a, a, a great warm uh, atmosphere before. You're getting on a central bus that's warm. Numbers Centro shared with us show it's pretty popular. 5,000 total riders for football season. That's 800 per game. To get to the four basketball games on Saturdays in December, 700 riders total, 175 per game. Centro estimates enough riders to take up to 250 cars off the streets and ease congestion. And we're told it's fun, at least for a five-year-old. Loves it. Loves it. He likes being on the bus in particular. Um, you're on the bus with other fans. So with the ride up, you're, you're experiencing that sort of game day feel. A win even before tip-off or kickoff. In Syracuse, Andrew Donovan, News Channel 9. Mm, great picture there. And yeah. Isn't that about being a Syracuse fan, though? Isn't it amazing that no matter how bad the weather is, they still always pack the dome? Doesn't oh, matter. Yeah, we always do. Yeah. Yeah. How to get there? <laughs> we're Central New Yorkers. Right. We're a hearty bunch. Right. The shuttles are only available on Saturdays. Tickets can be purchased at the Centro Hub, but you do need to get them at Shaughnessy's for parking to be validated. That is right. Well, many more people may.